knees will work your quadriceps, a little bit of your hamstring, and your glutes back here. So what I like to do is one leg at a time. These are called step ups. I'll take one leg, put it on a chair, and again, you can improvise and use other things that are available in your house, but you want to get your leg pretty much straight across, flat, okay, where my knee and my hip are about even or so. And I, I just use this chin up bar right here to keep myself balanced. So I'll hold on to it like this, but you don't need this. You can hold on to the side of a door, however you want to do it. But I will just kind of balance myself, get good position, and I will go up on one leg. Try to just let your leg do the work if you, the best you can and go back down. I don't go super fast. And I, I, I just go to where I can really feel it in my thighs and back down, up and back down. Do as many as I can until I feel fatigue in the muscle and then I'll just switch my legs and do it with my right, up and back down, straight up and back down. I'll do a couple sets on each leg um, until my thighs really feel like they're burning and worked. As soon as I get done with those, I'll do a couple sets of body weight squats. This is our third exercise. Body weight squats, very simple. I just leave the chair that I was using there, get myself in a nice comfortable position, and I will squat down until my butt touches the chair and come straight back up. When I go down, you want to make sure that my knees don't go past my toes. We never want to go on our toes when we go down. We want to keep that weight on the whole part of my foot, toward the back of it actually. So, it looks like this. Deep breath going down, let my butt touch and come back up. Back down, touch, come back up. And you're saying, but coach, I can do a ton of those. It's probably true, but if you burn out your legs first with the step ups, your legs will be pretty fatigued. Then when you go right to the body weight squats, then it'll feel a little bit tougher to you. So this is how I'm doing it, just like this, all right? Looks like I'm praying, and that's a good thing, especially right now. But those are three exercises for your legs that I'm currently doing since I normally go to a gym, but can't right now, that I'm currently doing in my home to try to keep my legs strong and developed the best I can. So I hope this helps you. Um, next week's will be workout will be how, how to work out our core. So until then, you guys stay safe, be healthy, and God bless you. Bye-bye.